What is it, me guys? It's Violet Taylor here, and welcome back to Let's Catch a Vibe. Now, I hope everyone's feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibey. As you guys can see, we are doing the Artem Shop Switchover. This video will be taking us from Monday the 6th of February into Tuesday the 7th of February. Now, you guys know we had some really, really cool items last night. We had the Eternal Struggle, we had the Edge Factor Bundle, we had the return of what I like to call the Chapter 1 OG skins, we had the bundles. We had some really cool items in the daily store, but what we're getting tonight in three, two, one, let's go! Again, very, very delayed. I do apologize. Anyway, as you guys can see, we had the return of some really, really cool items. So in the featured store, we had the return of the Baltic emote. I think this emote hasn't come back for a long time. That's why they put it smack bang in the featured store. So graceful. First introduced in chapter two, season three. Now when he's traversal, obviously as you guys can see, um, All Might has his cape wrapped around him, which, you know, ain't nothing new with Fortnite being buggy sometimes. Anyway, moving us on to the Fey Ballet Bundle. Now, this bundle is still kind of new-ish because it only came out Christmas. But yeah, some really, really cool items in here. She does have two styles. Pretty much all of her items have two styles. But anyway, uh, I have covered this in its own Is or Is Not Worth It bundle video. So you should find it relatively easily at the top of the playlist somewhere. Uh, but definitely recommend checking out in my Is It or Is It Not Worth It playlist on my channel. Moving us on to the return of the Stormlight bundle. I feel like we're just going to have loads of bundles tonight. Anyway, we've got the Stormlight bundle. Again, really, really cool bundle. They do have two styles. They have like a non-glow and then a glow version, as you guys can see in the background there. We also have an absolutely badass, and I mean badass, glide in the Mega Bat. Saw with the Storm. Part of the Stormlight set. Now, tell me that I had a really, really cool looking um, glider. I was going to say something else there, but it wasn't going to go on what I was going to say. Anyway, moving us on to the bottom half of the featured store. We have the return of the Starlit Archer Bundle. Again, really, really cool bundle. Only comes with three items. So, yeah, it, 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 it's one of those ones. If you really like the galaxy design, I would say go for it. I would say go for it in general because it is a cool skin. But just would have liked it if there was just, you know, you know, two more items so we can have a five item bundle. Anyway, moving on to the actual thing that we're covering in the featured store, here's other than the bundles, we have the return of the Shiver Skin, powered by Cold Fury. Part of the Ice Kingdom set, first introduced in Chapter 2, Season 1, looking very, very cool. Her horns do like have like a bit of a shine to them. She also has some flame um, animation around her wrist, and then on her hot, hot heels. <laughs> moving on to the Bat Bling, we have the Ice Wing. Frozen Fury. As you guys can see, there are some particle effects on the wings with like some glitter and some like what well, a cold smog basically. But anyway, moving us away from this skin, we have the return of the Frost Blade Harvesting Tool. Honed to Frosty Perfection. Again, love the nice little like it's like a steam vapor. Like, you know, when something's that cold, it has steam coming off it because obviously it's that cold. But yeah, very, very cool. Love the nice little grip there as well. Moving us on to the actual daily store. Don't worry, I'm going to actually cover some items in this video. We start ourselves off with the mail skin. In the mix and on the hunt. Part of the backbeat set, first introduced in Chapter 3, Season 1. Now, I absolutely love this skin. I just never know what to put it with, like, as a bat bling. I never know what bat blings to put with it. I could put one of the music ones as one that's, like, a, got a reactive speaker. But I just never know what to put with this skin. There's, like, nothing. It hasn't had anything. But the only thing I can see is, like, she's got, like, a spade on her right shoulder there. But she's got nothing. Like, I know they release uncommon skins like this. But for this one, I feel like it's just enough, ja like, it's just jazzy enough to have, like, something with it. But yeah, let me know in the comments down below what you guys use with this skin, if you have this skin. Moving us on to the return of the Bryce 3000 skin. Now, this one is reactive. So we check out my man, Mr. Bryce. Influencer, fashionista. More importantly, don't forget, he's a robot. Now, really, really cool. Part of the Robotics set. First introduced in Chapter 2, Season 3. You do have a bit of animation on him with the glasses, um, which is very, very cool. Uh, they like twitch and you know as you guys can see they like twitch and distort like there's a glitch going on Moving us on to his bat bling. We have the boom box 3000 here comes the boom box as you guys can see now the bat bling is reactive the equalizer reacts to music Which I think is very very cool. 
You also have like the old fashioned, um, what they're called now. It's been ages since I've used them. You know, the old fashioned, like red, white, uh, and yellow wire. Oh, what's it called? Is it AV? I think it's AV, isn't it? But anyway, you got the nice little red and it's like a nostalgia thing, basically. Anyway, enough of me talking rubbish. Moving on to the daily store, we have some really, really cool cards. Really, Really, really cool items return. We have the return of the Outburst Harvesting Tool. Burn Bright. Now, I can't remember. Was this in the um, Chinese New Year bundle set that we had? Or Chinese New Year item shop? Was this part of it? If it wasn't, then you guys can get the Outburst Harvesting Tool for one of the skins. Burning Bright. First introduced in the OG Season 7. Moving us on to the return of the Lama Cadabra. Don't forget the magic word. First introduced in the OG Season 6. Cheese! Don't just spawn one llama. Cheese! Now let me know in the comments down below how many llama corns were on, or evil llama corns, were on the screen at one time then. Let me know in the comments down below if you know the true answer. Moving us to the return of the synchronized emote, the Chess Master. King me. First introduced in Chapter 3, Season 2. Looking very, very cool. Moving us on to the return of the animated Code Green. A nice little bundle to grab if you guys are into the Matrix. Or this was like the original Matrix um, wrap. Anyway, obviously we have part of the Crypto Collective set. First introduced in Chapter 2, Season 2, and baby! You guys know that was my favourite season. But anyway... You guys know that code is nothing but a bunch of ones and zeros, which is very, very cool for those of you that like code. But anyway, oh, has it got a secret message in it? It's got some writing hidden between it. I want to know what it is, but I can't read it. It says something about shush, reboot, error. Oh, it's like, okay, so it's like computer things. Anyway, moving us on to the bottom half now, we still have the Dragon Ball collaboration with some really, really cool items. We have the Kid Leroy that is still with us. I think his concert is still available and I'm sure it's said until the 27th of like April. So it's quite a, quite a while away. Anyway, moving us on to his emotes. We still have the Icon series um, item shot takeover, which is very, very cool. We've got Alia, Cypher, Ninja, Booger, Lachlan, the Gref G, Laser Beam or Laser... No, see, it'd be... Where that A's would be easy if it was laser. But anyway, I'll just call him laser beam. Anyway, we've got loser fruit. We've got Chica. We then move on to the love is in the air. We are literally like a week away now. So we'll get a lot of these skins come back in the item shop for a week. We'll run it up to the week before Valentine's Day. But anyway, guys, nice little calm item shop for the Tuesday switch over. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to smash the like button. If you didn't enjoy the video, let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like the video. Also, let me know what is your favorite item from tonight's item shop. I might be a little bit late tomorrow doing some of the challenges if they bring some new challenges out. But I will, I promise, I will be doing a video on it tomorrow. I will not miss it tomorrow. But anyway, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new and join Team Nights Catch Up Vibe. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to switch on the bell notifications to get notified as soon as I upload. But more importantly, don't forget to stay vibey, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.